Uh, David Arce with the City of Wesaco Public Works Department. Um, we're here at uh, one of our most recent streets that we've done here in the Wesaco. With the asphalt zipper, we purchased our first one back in around 2005. Most recently, uh, as, as the city's growing, uh, we need to improve more streets. We needed a bigger, better option. We went back to asphalt zipper. We asked for their biggest, baddest they have. Uh, we bought the 720 with the water tank, which we didn't have before, and the tires in the front, which is way easier to control for our operators. Just like any other city, budgets, dollars that we're putting back into our streets, there's always constraints. So um, the idea behind getting this new asphalt zipper is trying to keep the same crew and, and being as efficient as we can with the personnel we have. So with this newer, bigger machine, we're able to zip more. We go about two inches down on the, on the old asphalt. Like this street ha here has bike lanes. So we want to make it as smooth as possible between the curb and the asphalt alignment. You know, we don't want our bike riders falling into a, you know, a one inch drop or a two inch drop and, and you know, have accidents. So what we do, we zip, we go from about two inches to a zero towards the middle, and then we overlay completely. On the smaller street, uh, we can have it zipped, cleaned, and ready for the overlay within three days. We're doing about a mile on this, on this project, and we're gonna continue about another mile and a half down the street. Again, we zip, we sweep, we prepare all the utility cuts around the manholes, around the water valves, etc. And then uh, we come back and we, we do our overlay with the same team. The zipper, it's so easy. I mean, it, the guys love it. Just like anything else, everything gets better with time. Previously, there was a lot of dust issues. With the new system that we, they have with the water tank, it, it dust control is minimized completely. So the improvements that Asphalt Dipper's done, the guys love it, the operators love it. Not, not from the director's point of view, from the operators, the ones that actually use it. Give them the right equipment, let them go with it and they'll take care of you guys. So on average, one third the price if we do it in house. Now we're able to double that productivity with the same crew. If you're not zipping, you're spending money, you're spending time that you can be more efficient. And, and, that's, and that's, that's really what this machine does. It, it really makes you more efficient you don't need the huge crew. And that helps obviously, because year after year, we try to stretch that dollar as much as we can. We recycle what we're picking up from here and we're re repurposing it in, into alleys, into trails, uh, where we, we lay it down as a base and we roll it. And, and now the old stuff becomes new and we give it a second life. I mean, you, you, saw, them, you saw them doing it, they, they, they love it. I mean, these guys, it's like anything else. You have the right equipment, you're going to be more productive. This is the right equipment for this type, this, this job.